999. 1,000. Oh, hey, just finishing up my workout for the day. Just a couple cool down reps. All right, I'm going to take you guys through Saturday's whiteboard briefing. Nothing too crazy today. Uh, a couple different Metcons wrapped into one, but uh, not a lot that you haven't seen before. All right, equipment workout. Uh, we got to start out. You're going to do this on your own. Remember, we have a Zoom class at uh, 9 a.m., okay? So on your own, your nine-minute EMOM, 30-second wall sit march. I will demo those in one second. 20 alternating pike shoulder taps and 40-second glute bridge, okay? Uh, if you have no equipment, just sub those pike shoulder taps for down dog shoulder taps, okay? Wall sit march. Watch and learn. Get you a good wall. Nothing changes. You're just one at a time, legs straight out, all right? Okay? There's your warm-up. Get that done before 9 a.m. I'd suggest starting about 15 or 20 minutes before. Give yourself time to prep and be ready. Our Metcon. We got three seven-minute AMRAPs with three-minute rest in between each one. Number one, you're going to go two, four, six, eight, ten ascending reps by two per round. You're going to start out kettlebell and or dumbbell swing. Sorry, not an or or an and. or Only an or. All right. Uh, push up and then in between each round you're going to uh, do 50 double unders um, before you move on to the next round. So two swings, two push ups, 50 double unders, four, four, 50, five, or six, six, 50, eight, eight, 50, 10, 10, 50, and then keep going. All right, for the no equipment, you're going to do broad jumps and push ups, and you're going to do 30 jumping jacks in between rounds. So two broad jumps, two push ups. 30 jumping jacks, 4, 4, 30, 6, 6, 30, 8, 8, 30, on, so on and so forth. Seven minutes comes to an end. We're going to have a three-minute rest. AMRAP 7, number 2, 20 mountain climbers, 5 dumbbell or kettlebell snatch on the right side only, all right? 5 dumbbell or kettlebell snatch, or sorry, push press right side only 20 tuck jumps five dumbbell or kettlebell snatch left side five dumbbell kettlebell push press left side all right so snatch from the floor up overhead all right push press from the shoulder dip drive okay um tuck jumps Jump and tuck those feet as high as you can. Get them up. Get them up. Then you're going to do the five on the left side snatch. Push press. Okay. Run through that as many rounds as you can for seven minutes. Uh, for the um, no equipment, 20 mountain climbers, so that stays the same. You're going to do 10 odd object ground overhead on the right side. You're going to do... 20 tuck jumps, that stays the same. 10 odd object ground to overhead on the left side. So odd object, a uh, jug of milk, a uh, can of ammo, uh, beanie weenies, uh, an old tire. You know, have at it. Have fun with that one. All right. Many rounds as you can in seven minutes. Brings me to another three-minute rest. And our final seven-minute AMRAP. Equipment wide. 16 alternating step ups. Use what you got. Bucket, box, couch, steps, 20 inch box, 24 inch box, whatever you can work with. 10 handstand push ups or pike handstand push ups. Probably use the same thing for the pike handstand push ups that you did your step ups on. And 12 L crunch. I'll give those a demo real quick. So on your back, feet up like an L. And you're just reaching up, getting those toes. Back to your shoulders, up, try to get to those toes. My legs are longer than my, my, my arms are long, so that's why I couldn't touch my toes there. It had nothing to do with my flexibility. And then, final seven-minute AMRAP for my no-equipment folks. You're going to do 16 alternating forward lunges. So you're just lunging, stepping forward. 
uh, eight on each side there, 10 yoga push-ups, and then 12 of those L crunches that I just demoed. All right, guys, y'all are ready to rock and roll. It is the weekend. Get it out of the way. I think phase one is getting released here pretty soon, so uh, maybe Saturday evening you get to hang out with some pals you ain't seen in a while.